seconds are like days, ain't that upset? So why do I bother? But nothing can compete. I think it's safe to say that today has not been a good vlog day because I've run around in meetings and the kind of meetings that you can't really bring a camera to. So I figured that we'll try to start now. And since it's a meeting day, We'll do a bunch of Q&A to start with and then we'll see what happens later on in the day. And I figure that we we could start with a good question about what does your family think about the whole vlog and a camera being around all the time and I thought that was a good question because right now I'm walking around with a camera in my hand in the middle of the city and I kind of still feel weird about it. I guess it's a matter of getting used to. I know Yanni doesn't like to film when we're in the city when there's a bunch of people around but overall I don't think People seem to be um, enjoying being a part of the vlog. So, so far we've been good. I guess we'll see how it comes along in the future. And then of course, there's the Huracan. I know there's a lot of question what's going on with the Huracan. And I just spoke to Stuckman a couple weeks ago and the Huracan should be ready engine, exhaust, uh, brakes and suspension wise in about three weeks. So in three weeks, I'll have a very fast car. And then we're gonna save the body kit for later this fall because I want to drive the car during the summer. So I'm trying to grow up and be more responsible in terms of uh, doing everything at once. So in three weeks, we should have a very fast car on this block. In terms of stabilizers, people wonder, you have a stabilizer, why don't you use it more? We're still waiting for the stabilizer for the Leica. So as soon as I have that, we will have a very stable shot instead of me carrying this around, being a bit shaky because the, the Leica with its full on setup gets a bit heavy to carry after a while. So I know you wonder how we make the workflow work with the video blogs and as you can see I'm sitting here in some random place and I just imported the first couple parts of the shots and in nine minutes I gotta be in a meeting so I'm trying to just optimize it all but um, this is my workstation to start the video blog of today. And now I could probably pack up and get going because I don't think I'm supposed to talk this loud in here. So we'll see you once I'm done with this meeting. Thank you. Ooh. Today is one of those days where I don't have enough time and I'm constantly late to every meeting. Right now I'm going to Jonas to um, get my back fixed. He is to me the best guy in Stockholm to get help with so hopefully he can help my back to get better. Finally. Sorry I'm late. No problem. <laughs> chaos day. How was your day? Chaos? Chaos, chaos, chaos. 100% chaos. But now we're here, so now we're gonna get my back fixed because my back keeps acting up. Yeah. And Jonas is the man. He's always uh, helping me, trying to stay in shape. Yeah. So I'm gonna put the camera away and now focus on what we should actually do. Okay. <laughs> now we are going to get some exercises done so that I can prevent my back from getting bad. Yeah. And of course, I didn't bring any training stuff, so I'm rocking my boxers. It's perfect for business. Yeah, I mean, there's no one watching anyway. <laughs> down and forward as an escalator. Yeah, and press that hands against the calves. Push your left hip flexor forward. Can you feel the stretch? Mm -hmm. Knee out. Yeah, and you can look up. Looks so simple, but it's like annoying. You don't have much weight and it's still really tough, especially mentally. You're just like, come on, I just want to stop now. <laughs> yeah, I was called fat on the blog, so yes, I should work on this. You he was? Yeah, Yanni was grumpy, I was fat, and Marcus was going bald. Yeah? <laughs> Welcome to internet life. <laughs> See, it's already improving. Yeah, but it's with a little kipping. A little kipping. <laughs> it was the fat talk that got me motivated. <laughs> so I, I actually came in for treatment, ended up being a workout, so I had to work out in my beautiful undies, but it felt good to get some workout after all the meetings. Thank you. Thank you, June. I always love coming to Jonas because he keeps telling me to be smart about training instead of just doing beach training and being stupid. So it's good to get reminded. 
He is smart. No, I'm not that smart. I try to be, but... <laughs> you're, you're hard. To, you're, I think you're too hard on yourself. You're smart and you can do the hard work, but you can always do a little better, right? <laughs> I can always do better. So summertime, here I come. I'm going to get in shape, but not like looking good shape, but actually feeling good shape. That's the goal. And here we are walking around with cameras looking like weirdos. Yeah, and I got my beastie and my new slack line. It's going to be an awesome summer. <laughs> We are ready for summer. So I'm gonna hang a left here and then I will see you later. <laughs> no friend. <laughs> see you later. See you later, you. Thanks for everything. Bye. Ciao. And I guess we can follow that up with a question I've seen a lot, and that is whether I get reimbursed for Red Bull I buy on the road. And no, I do not. I get to order free Red Bull, but I always forget, so then I end up buying a bunch of Red Bull. The most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to me, I don't know. I did open a um, bottle of water on the pharmacy just now and there was too much bubble and it was shaken so I spilled water, water all over my pants and the floor on the pharmacy just five minutes ago. There's lots of people looking at me real weird while I was holding a camera covered in water. So that was pretty embarrassing I would have to say. Other than that I can't really think of anything. And the last question before I end today's vlog because today's today just ran away from me. I had kind of a plan to do a Q&A, but all the meetings ran long and I was like an hour behind the whole day. So the last question is, was yesterday's uh, juice bar visit planned or not? And no, it was not. I've never met the guy before, but he was for sure awesome. So now I'm going to go pack up, edit, and then I'm heading off to Norway tomorrow morning to do a bunch of board meetings. So I will see you guys once we get to Norway.